Hey guys, welcome to another video. And today we're gonna continue our Undertale. Now there was no save, so we you start out here. And I and if you're probably wondering there's something weird, like if you guys don't know, you know what? Forget it. We're just gonna continue on. Forget what I was gonna say. Oh, should probably get my mouse out of the way for you guys. There we go. Hmm. Can I? No, I'm just gonna step on it. Why not? Does it? Oh, I guess you can just walk around it. Um. Why did it just crack all of a sudden? That's weird. There's no one. What? What, what was that? You know what? I keep walking. Just gonna keep walking. Uh, I I can't move. Oh God, I can't move. Someone help me. Who's that? Oh my God, someone help me. Human. I'm not a human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Hey, hey, the old movie cushion and the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sid, Sam the Skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on a watch for humans right now, but, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, Papyrus, he is a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, that, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide for anyone to stop anything. I mean, anyone. Sorry, I was looking through my camera and there's stuff on the screen. Quick, behind the behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Yeah, it looks exactly like me for some reason. Sup, bro? You know what? Sup, brother? It's been eight days, and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at, the, at this lamp. It's really cool. Do you want to look? No! I do not have time for that. But if a human comes through, I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the Great Papyrus will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect. Recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans! You are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've got a ton of work done today. A skeleton. Sons! Come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it! <sighs> Why does someone as great as me have to do so much to get some... Just get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. Ugh! I will tend to my puzzles. As for you, as for your work, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> That's a little mean. I mean, hey. 
It's a little mean that they only made jokes for Saiyans, but when Papyrus made a joke, it's kind of sad. It's not really unfair to Papyrus. Oh, by the way, if you guys are wondering why I didn't do much voice acting for Toriel, I didn't... I'm not really good with Toriel's voice. I mean, I, I guess I did an okay job. Anyways, I'm, I think I'm nailing the Papyrus voice. Okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of his hilarious jokes. Or more of my... Hilarious jokes, not his. Because his jokes suck. Apparently. I guess I can't go back there. There's like an invisible wall. Can I go behind these... Nope. I have to go down the path. But isn't Papyrus down that way? For some reason, it like, won't walk me... Won't let me walk here. Like, the... It's not even touch... The edge of the tree is not even touching me. Oh. Actually, hate to bother you, but can I... Can you do me a favor? I was thinking. My brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before. And seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry. He's not... Dangerous. If he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. I mean... Papyrus... Wait, 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 wait. Didn't... Why did he... If he says he was gonna be up ahead, why did he walk backwards? Back there. Uh, okay. <gasps> Finally a save point! The convenience of the lamp still fills with determination. Box Road. Oh, box. I'll read the sign first. This is a box. You can put an item inside, or take an item out. The same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. Oh! Oh, okay, a box lover. Use this box? Yeah, sure. Ooh! A tough glove. Um... I'm gonna put that toy knife away, because I don't want that. A tough glove. I'll keep the butterscotch pie and stuff. I need to get more. Oh! Oh, a snow drink. Flares forth. Um, can I mercy it already? Nope! Gotta fight it. I mean, we'll talk. Jilk. You make a bad ice pun. Is that supposed to be funny? Oh, new attack, new attack. Oh, I don't know how I dodged that. Check. Snow Drake, 12 attack, defense, 7. This team comedian fights to keep a com um, a captive audience. Sorry if I'm fumbling up my words, it's just really hard. Better not snowflake, uh, I don't know what he said. I think it was a pun. So I'm just gonna laugh. You like that snow drink's pun. See? Last, Dad was wrong. Oh. Is. Okay. Okay, spoilers right now. Here's gonna be a spoiler. Oh, 12 gold. Ooh, that's good. Okay. So here's the spoiler starting now. In the next, skip 10 seconds forward. So, um. Starting now. In Hotlands, if you guys haven't already seen it, which is like after a waterfall. Oh wait, hold on. And then after a waterfall, um, his dad is actually works at the MTT Resort. So, anyways, yeah, that's cool. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in. Yeah, sure. Why not? It's all that attached. To the end is a photo of a weird-looking monster. Call me. Here's my number. You decided not to call. I guess I, I wanted to call the monster. Maybe he can help me. He or she could help me. So, as I was saying about Undyne... <laughs> they were spinning. Oh my god, is that a human? Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Oh. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? 
Oh my god! Is- is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! By the way, without Sans, how would Papyrus even know what a human is? I mean, think about it. <laughs> Undying Will! I'm gonna... I'll be so... Popular! 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 Ahem. <clears throat> human, you should not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Sorry, I'm losing my voice, guys. When he talks again, then I'll use my voice better, because I need to drink water. Hold on. Then, then, I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Are you sure? Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye suck get out for you. Okay, the puns are getting pretty bad. Sorry, guys. I've been in talk for a couple seconds. I had to drink some water because I need to warm up my papyrus voice. Uh, ice cap. Okay, compliment, ignore, steal. Compliment. You inform my scout that he has a. He is. That it's. You inform Ice Cap that it has a great hat. Envious? Too bad. Oh! Okay. Um, let me check it. Ice Cap, attack. I'll just wait for you guys to read that. Your heads look. Your head looks so naked. Oh my god. These attacks are hard to do. Cause I have so, I have big side buttons, but I don't have big up buttons. Compliment. Duh. Who doesn't know? Okay, this attack. Oh. Oh shoot. Okay, how are you supposed to dodge that? I'm just gonna run away, cause I... There's a narration on this cardboard box. You observed the well-crafted Sunray Station. Who could have built this? You ponder. I bet it was that very famous Rhodes Guardman. No, not yet very famous Rhodes Guardman. Huh. Well, I need, I need, I need health. Absolutely no moving. Okay. Oh. Did something move? Was it, was it my imagination? I can only see something, see moving things. If someone was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. No, hold on. Act. Pet. Don't go too suspicious for your movements. Don't move an inch. He's excited by movement. How do you include squirrels? Let move this time. Nope, nothing. I'm not moving. Will that move this time? Try to pet it. You pet doggo. What? I've been pet. The attacks are probably gonna get harder. Oh, I guess we just have to stay still if it's blue. Well, I know how that works. Thank god if I didn't, I would be screwed. Act. Oh wait, I can spare him now. Yes! 38 gold. I mean, 30 gold. Something pet me. Something that isn't moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Oh, what's this? Someone has been smoking dog treats. Uh, well, let's see. Oh, we can call- let's see if we can call Toriel. Nobody picked up. I can't- well, she said don't come back, but can't we just talk to her? And she could give us tips or something?
We only have our butterscotch pie, but I don't want to eat that. Because that's the only member we have left of her. Hey, Sans. Hey, uh. Here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move, and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Oh. Oh, I need to read that sign. North ice, south ice, west ice, east, snowed in town. And ice. I'm gonna go up here first. Oh, let's see. Hello, I am a snowman. I like to see the world, but I cannot move. If you'll be so kind, traveler, please take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Uh, what piece? Thank you. Good luck. You got the snowman. You got the snowman's piece. Uh, it doesn't look like I took anything out of him. By the way, um, there's a complication about taking him, but you know, I'm not gonna say. Lesser dog appears. Act. Head. You barely lifted your hand when Lesser dog got excited. Oh my god! I need to spare him. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. You're so lazy! You were napping all night! I think that's called sleeping. Excuses, excuses, ex Oh, ho! Oh, the human arrives, in order to stop you. My brother and I have created pu some puzzles. I need to adjust the camera for you guys. Because I might be a little off if you guys can't read that, sorry. I didn't notice it till now. I think you will find this one quite shocking for you for you see this is isn't the this is the invisible electricity maze this orb will administer a hearty zap sounds like fun because this amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small I think okay you can go ahead now Sans, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. Okay, try now. Uh, gotta be extra careful about this. Incredible, you slippery snail. Toriel reference. You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother, Sense. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> hey, thanks. My brother seems to like having his fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made it a few weeks ago at a costume for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. I keep calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? Yeah, sure is. <gasps> yes! Who are you? You look cool. Haha, <laughs> pun because we're in Snowden. Or we're in. Yeah, Snowden. I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's a perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer! Would you like some ice cream? Uh, how much is it? It's a frozen treat that warms your heart. Not just 15G, sure. Here you go. Have a super day. You got ice cream. I'll buy some more. Cause I need to... I need to buy a couple more. I need to buy more. I need to buy so much more! Okay, I think that's good. I'll buy one more. Now I need to heal myself. Items. Oops. Beautiful day. You had a wonderful. You have a wonderful day. You recovered 15 HP. 
that's so that's such relief. Now I don't have to die. I haven't died at all. Uh, what? what oh. Okay. Um. Not sure what I'm supposed to do with this. Uh, no. I'm just gonna, I guess, just push it down here. Something. Oh, wait, there's a hole there. Ah, no. Sorry, guys. For some reason, I got stuck. I can't go for some. I can't move for some reason. Oh, did it all the way? Except I set all the way back here. Cause okay, for some reason my keypads were off. I don't. Or my can these. Well, I think Snowden Town, where he said that was that probably be the next episode. Um. Got it. I'm getting close, I'm getting close, I'm getting close. Oh god, gotta move over here. I made it anyways. Now what did that do? I'm gonna talk to Sans first. I've been thinking about selling treats too. You want some fried snow? It's just 5G. Uh, sure. Did I say 5G? I meant 50G. Yeah, sure. Really? How about 5,000G? That's my final offer. Bye. What? You don't have the money. Hey, that's okay. I don't have any snow. What if I actually did have the money? Well, how would he react? I mean, it's probably rare that I would have that. But, you know. It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow... Human. I hope you're ready for... Sons, where's the puzzle? It's right there. On the ground. Trust me. There's no way they can get past this one. Hey kids, can you help me solve this? Are you serious? Okay. Sons, that didn't do anything! Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you say that. Or you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really? Cr dude, that's easy peasy word scramble. That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Um, crossword or Junior Jumble? I do want to agree with Sans, but. Junior Jumble is... It depends on the Jumble. So Jumble is kind of hard for me. So I would go with Jumble. Ha ha, yes! Humans must be very intelligent. If they find Junior Jumble so difficult. <laughs> Plus, I guess it'll build up his self-esteem. Self Thanks for saying Junior Jumble just to, appe to appease my brother. Yesterday, he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Well, guys, I'm just gonna go check what's up here first. All the way up here. What's up here? His? Hers. Smell danger rating. Snow smell, white snowman rating can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious puppy, blue rating, smell of rolling around. Weird smells, human, green rating, destroy at all costs. Okay. Guessing that they don't want to see me. His and hers don't want to find me. Noted. Um, seriously, what does this do? Like, what does this snow thing do? No idea. I'm gonna try to put it in one more time. Before the episode ends, and then we'll continue on. I don't know what this does. To be honest, I'm being serious right now. I have no idea what this does. Is this just golf? Uh, I don't know what that D 
did. I just reset already. Yeah, I have no idea what that does. To be honest. Oh, I guess I'm running low on time. Well, oh, here's a save point, just in time. We'll read this first. It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy the spaghetti. Little do you know, the spaghetti is a trap. It's designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly japed against by the great Papyrus. <laughs> papyrus. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's cold, it's stuck to the table. I mean, it's so cold that it's stuck to the table. It's an unplugged microwave. All the settings say spaghetti. I'm just gonna save. Knowing that the mouse one day might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti. It feels its determination. Wait, what? Oh, there's a little mouse hole here! Oh, that's so cute! Hey, I wonder if I can shrink down to that size and just go through the hole and meet C. Troyel again. I wonder if that. Uh, well, oh, I'm gonna go back to the save. Well, guys, that's all I'm gonna do for today. Um, we've progressed. We've met Sans and Papyrus. So that's good. We've encountered some monsters. We have bought a bunch of nice cream. We also got a tough glove and a snowman piece. And we dropped the knife down in a in a box somewhere a, 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 a box yeah a box somewhere back there so that's basically a recap of what we did um yeah so thank you all for watching this episode and i will see you guys in the next episode bye